All right, in this video, I'm just going to show everyone how to use DDCV6, Despardial Dell Symmetrial V6, to upgrade to 4.01 M33 off that. All right, the first thing, just download in the video description, um, Memory Stick, Magic Memory Stick DDCV6. All right, first, go to your PSP and format your memory stick. So, System Settings. Format memory stick. Right now, I don't know how everyone put uses their memory stick to put it into your computer, but you can use USB mode. I actually use my PC, so just wait one second. There we go. Now it's going into the PC. Alright, now find your drive letter. It should look like this after you formatted it. Alright, now go onto the files I said to download. Just double click them 4.0 and MP3. And PSP Greater Light, install that. It shouldn't take too long to install. But install it, and while it's installing, you could copy and paste. Just go to 4.1 on everything in here. You could just click and drag to removable disk J. This is what you need to have it look like if you're beginning of your memory stick. See? Okay, now just let it go and say yes to all. It's gonna copy, 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 copy. You also have to have a Pandora battery to do this. It's the only way it can be can be done. Seems to take forever to copy. You can just exit out of this folder. The PSP and TM. All those. So you can just spend on the copying. Thirty five seconds remain, seems like forever to me. But I'm also gonna show you this doing it on a slim. A PSP slim. And as you can tell you can see the little things, well not really. It's small, has that. So I have a slim and a fat. So I'm going to show you doing both of them. Okay, now that's copied. Minimize that. And run PSP Grader. Okay, you should get this nice menu PSP Grader V5. Okay, you have to have a 3.9. Well, no, not for this. You don't need a 3.9 boot. So just erase that. You don't need any of these. You don't need to format your memory stick. Just go down to eject IPL only. It's a nice little menu. It all sells on. Okay. Exit out. Alright, now you're good. Go to your computer. Get out your memory stick. First, I'm going to go for the fat. I'm going to put it in the fat. Then I'm going to create a battery. So I'll just take a second.
Now, when you're turning on the PSP, turn it on and hold the up button, this arrow key up. So just insert your battery. The power automatic turn on. Keep holding up. See if power's on. Mario stick is being loaded, and you get this nice little menu. It'll say install 4.01 MD3, install 4.01 original firmware, NAND operations, hard drive info, test MD3, shut down and reboot device. Alright, this is nice that you can install at 4.01 MD3, original firmware, NAND, op NAND operations. Your hardware information will say like what it is, um, like I have a fat right here. Motherboard TA82. Um, you can test M33, which that does is you don't really install three M33. It just like is there, and once you take once you take out the Pandora battery and put a regular battery in, it will not be custom firmware anymore. So that's for people if they don't really want to do it. But if you keep the Magic Memory Stick in there, and Pandora tests like an ISO homebrew whatever, it will work that way. Alright, see, so I'm not going to show you installing it because I'll show you with the slim too. So I'm just going to turn this off. And you know, I'm just going to use the same battery and the fat for the slim. Because I don't feel like making another one. So you got the memory stick. Now you get to the slim. Alright, same procedure. Hold up the up arrow key. So hold that once you put in the battery. Alright, we'll turn on. It will flash. And the same menu boots up. Install 4.01 MT3. Install 4.0 original firmware NAND operations. Hardware information. Test MT3 shutdown and reboot device. So that shows you can do with both slim and fat. Alright, thank you for watching. I hope you subscribe to all my videos, rate, comment, and everything else. Thank you for watching.